patient with me. Someone to get money when I take it from me. They don't even need to be as famous as me. I don't think I meet them at the places I be. But deep down, I think about you all day. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Key Dewan, formerly known as Keeping Up with Key. And today we're gonna be doing well today. This week is maintenance week. <laughs> so we're gonna be getting my hair done, my lashes done, washing my hair, you know, doing all the good stuff. And y'all know taking the everything shower. Y'all know what everything shower is. That means we're doing a scrub. Um, I really shave. Cause I'm not like generally hairy I can get away with it <laughs> but like doing our scrub I'm doing just our full like body routine and let me show y'all what I just got so I picked up a couple of things at Sephora the other day I'm starting with this oh my god I don't even know how to pronounce it but everyone talks about it way or O-U-A-I I don't know how to say it but I got the scalp and body scrub I really just want to use it for my scalp I have like a separate body scrub already so I'm excited to try this out man like this is like a whole self-care thing but I got this mask from Sephora this actually scored a hundred out of a hundred on Yuka and they're only five dollars so get into it this one is for pore perfecting and smoothing and I'm finally gonna try the Dr. Dennis Gross Universal Daily Peel I'm just going to exfoliate and I feel like my like weekly exfoliator is just like not really doing anything but I'm still going to try these, like the little pads. I never even unboxed the wig to see what it looked like. And what if it's ugly and I don't want my hair done no more? <laughs> I've ordered from... Is this even mine? Hold on. What is this? Oh. Girl, they didn't confuse me. They didn't... <laughs> Y'all, I'm this This is not no wig. The wig is in here. Oh my god. Okay, Wiggins. Oh, ooh. I love Wiggins because I always give you a wig cap. Oh, they gave me a comb. Y'all, they gave me some nails. This is nice. And some little lashes. Okay, Wiggins. I right, they never gave me nothing like this. Like, shout out to Wiggins. <laughs> This is like my like third or fourth wig from them though, so it's well deserved. So I got a body wave. I didn't even know I ordered 26 inch. I'm really forcing it. Hold on, because I didn't even know I had ordered that length. Oh my god. I'm opening it like it's a present. Sp uh, sponsor me. So I got a 26 inch closure. Oh, that is really soft. That's so cute. Is that even 26 inches? I don't know, cause it don't seem like it's down to my butt. Oh, probably cause it's body wave, though. Like if it was like if it was like straightened out, it'd probably be down. Let's see. Okay, it might get 20, 26 inch, like straightened out. But I didn't even need it super. I didn't even really need it super long though. <laughs> like it's my birthday or something. I don't even know what length I had got for my oh I had an updo for my birthday. I ain't wearing no long hair. Uh, uh. This is too cute. Like what? Wow. I feel special. I might just wear these. These look long though. Y'all know I don't really do well with press ons. I don't know what I be doing when I be um getting lit. But they probably gonna pop off. I ain't gonna lie. Cause I'm I'm very much like like pistol princess when I dance like mm, mm, mm. I mean I ain't gonna hold y'all I'm a pistol princess who shake on occasion you know do a little mm, mm. y'all can't see but it's like doing I'm like doing it in a circle that's like when the pretty music come on or you know do a little slow wine do the Nikki slow wine the It's in, in the park. That's when you get like main character. Ah! I've only heard that song in a club like maybe twice. And it's like I really miss. Uh, I don't want to get all off into it, but we could talk about it a little bit. I kind of wish like I was born at a certain time, like maybe just like 
Okay, I don't really wish this. I don't want this to come true. But, like, imagine back then when you was in the club when, if you see us in the club, like, they used to dance. And I feel like our club culture now is, like, kind of, I don't even want to say, for lack of better words, toxic. Like, just not fun because people so worried about keeping up an image, like, who who got, um, who can get a section, who popping the most bottles. Like, everything has become this competition when we came here to dance. And you lose that dancing element because they swapped out the dance floor for sections. And it's like, you're not really getting that sense of, like, feeling comfortable to, like, go go try to talk to somebody if you ain't got a section or a bottle. Or, like, you know, just that whole human experience of mingling and having fun and not caring. Because we all just here to drink and have a good time. Now we all drinking. We all looking at each other sectioned off. And like that's cool you want to go you only want to talk to your friends but we still need to dance for it <laughs> like now we too good to dance why are we here listening to loud music and drinking if we're not even gonna hit the little or you know a little and the party she just wanna rump big boozing the best day pump but like you have to go I want a variety I want there to be like places where you do want a section usually you want a section when some a big name is coming to your city like of course I will if little baby coming I want to be in little baby section Jada don't kill him I'm just, I don't, it's not like that I'm just saying I'm just making a point here I imagine her, da -da 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 they probably was kind of up on the dance floor like Bring that back. Bring that back. If you live in this state where I live, bring, tell the promoters that's what I want. That's what the club owners tell. The people want that experience, you know? I'm going to ask my mom about her club experience. Okay, now I'm about to go get in the shower and do my little scalp treatment and stuff. I just want to get my hair washed and everything out the way before my lash appointment. Because my lash appointment comes before my hair appointment. And I don't want to, you know, get water in my eyes, wet my lashes. Within 24 hours so yeah be right back guys all right good morning here we are with the results of my hair being blown out oh that that's not cute I don't know if I showed y'all what I've used in my hair before but I used the Aura Bay shampoo for moisture control um it on the box it said like it was good for like kinkier hair I like it it smells good it's nice and I use Olaplex number no. 5 bond maintenance conditioner it repairs strengthens and nourishes all hair types because uh, my hair it needs some it needs some help it needs something I don't know and I heard Olaplex is really good but then I tried um today has like a lot of samples but I tried the dry bar cure liquor strengthening conditioner and the strengthening shampoo and these they smell like normal. They smell like hair products. Look, like I don't know how to describe it. Like just like if somebody was to gift you something random and it was shampoo and conditioner, like this is how it smelled. I don't even know if that even made sense. But now for like my favorite part, and my skin feels so soft. It smells so good. Well, I've already showed y'all my Tree Hut pineapple scrub. Um, then I go in with this little number of as, as I said before, while my skin is still damp. But today I use this. Laura Mercier Amber Vanilla Body Cream. This, oh my god, it smells so good. But when you put this on top, it's like chef's kiss. Like, I know everybody like this poor ass girl using a bunch of samples. Like, I just wanted to try them out. And it got the job done. Trust me, it got the job done, babe. Just trying out a bunch of new stuff. And now we're gonna get into the skincare. Been here for 10, but I feel like a rookie. I tell her, look up, cause it's snowing in Tussie. Book for three years, and you can't even book me. It's me and little baby, the shit going crazy. Okay, I put this in the fridge for dramatic effect. I hope that was okay. It doesn't stay, like, store at a certain temperature, I don't think. But, I only have to leave it on for five minutes. I might leave it in longer. I just be wanting stuff to, like, really, like, get in there. Juicy. Mmm. I'm just really surprised it scored so high on Yuka because you know like when it comes to like store owned like skincare and stuff it's kind of like makes you want to raise an eyebrow but yeah I'm, da I'm down with it I'm down not saying Yuka is the end all be all for me because 
I have some things that um, scored poor, but if it worked for me, it worked. It worked for me. It worked. Ah! <laughs> oh, okay. I'll be confused at who they make these masks for because who lips, who mouth is fitting through this hole? And like my eyes, I don't want to like get into my eyes. All I'm missing is like eye patches. I want some eye like mask so eye patches so bad i don't know which ones to get i was thinking about getting the ones from topicals because everybody kind of loves them but i don't want to be like i don't want to be influenced i want to like find some stuff that i just want to try on my own you know okay i would have left it on longer but again my appointment is in like 30 minutes let's just massage everything in Look at those motions. I don't have a J roller, but I learned this from our Chanel AE. Just like, what are they called? The the motions. And I like treat yourself. Treat yourself to these motions of getting that product in. Since I didn't wait the full five minutes, I just feel like this is like very necessary right now. And I wanted to do this mask before I get my lashes done because. Oh, I forgot to exfoliate. That's what I meant to do. It's okay. It's all it's all good. It's all good in the hood. <laughs> Y'all, he did by Beyonce has literally been stuck in my head. I, it's like I don't know. Like I love the album, of course, and that song wasn't even like one of my favorites, and now it's just like a staple for me. Another thing I'm missing is a good eye cream, too. If y'all want to recommend eye creams, please drop them in the comments. Or just, like, eye patches. Even though I said I wasn't gonna, I don't want to be, like, influence, influence, like, something that's popular. Like, tell me what eye patches and eye creams y'all use, please. Y'all, I seen the oddest post. The other day, it was like, I'm scared. Ooh. I'm scared of black people that I use sunscreen. Y'all do know skin cancer that isn't racist, right? It don't discriminate. Put that, put that sunscreen on. So we're going to do, boom, boom. This is the adequate amount, word to Tierra. Y'all might think it's too much, but you need to get like your ears, your chest, your neck, if you feel like you're, you know, all of this is too much for your face. But it's not. It's literally not. And it is a little sunny outside. Well, just be, just wear your sunscreen. I don't have to, I'm not going to fight with y'all and explaining all why I should wear sunscreen. You should get it by now. One thing that I learned while working in the beauty department is that you're supposed to reapply this every four hours or something like that. Like, isn't that crazy? I've never known that my whole life up until like last year. Um, I need a good body sunscreen too. Like, I kind of want to spray on, and they say you should only use, like, a mineral sunscreen. So, I'm going to look for that at some point in my life. I don't know when, but I am going to pick it up one of these days. Yeah, I almost forgot my camera. Let me moisturize my lips real quick. Do I think my hair will be in the way? I think it's, like, parted, so that it should be fine, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, we don't want to have ashy lips, though. Oh, shit, my keys. are so cute I got volume this time I think last time I did like hybrid and I want like wispy cat eye but this time it's just full on cat eye and I went to TL like I did last time she's in a new shop and she finally returned <laughs> but I'm just so excited I think Tia's like perfect to go to she's just so sweet and like really good with like explaining everything and just making you feel comfortable so yeah go to Tia's place of lashes I just warmed up these sausage biscuits and I like hope they're good. I feel like 
They had a Tennessee Pride like sausage biscuits. Aren't they so adorable? Yeah, I remember those like um, Frappuccinos from Starbucks in the glass when they released those. I feel like the price is like crazy now. Like inflation is real. But I tried something new instead because I was going to buy a four pack. But I, I like, I'm like, why not get an iced espresso? Because there's espresso and it's going to give me energy. So I got the vanilla latte one. I, everyone knows I love vanilla. So I'm probably going to take this to my appointment. Not bad. It's not as sweet as like the other one. Like if I can mix the two together, I would. But it'll do because espresso is bitter. Y'all, I realized that over time, I'm really a jam girl. My grandma keeps jam at her house. And in this household, they are jelly people, which I like. Like, nothing's wrong with jelly. I just think I prefer jam. Like, a good strawberry or raspberry, even grape jam. I feel like it seems more... I don't know, more trustworthy? Like, this consistency of jelly and the consistency of jam. Like, jam, I believe it's like real fruit <laughs> where I'm like jelly is just like this what is this called jello but we gonna work I'ma do it a bit wait what did Mariah Carey say I'ma work with what I got I don't know y'all know what I'm trying y'all know what I'm trying to say I don't know I'm not mad at this and I did not feel like cooking breakfast like mm -mm. this is less time consuming I hope now that I just thought about it, I hope I do not have to use the bathroom when, like, I go for my hair appointment. Because, <laughs> you know, coffee be running right through me, y'all. I have on my skin stress, if y'all want to know. A long sleeve cotton rib. I believe it's called. I literally love this color. I love this cut of this dress. Um, the only thing I need is an actual balconette bra. I actually have on a Skims bra. I'm sorry, I can't think of the style right now. Um, but it like cuts pretty low. It's like a demi cup, which is like, <sighs> it's hard to find like a good demi cup bra for my size because I wish it was just like one more cup up. It's still comfortable nonetheless. I still wear it like it takes some readjusting, but preferably a balconette bra is what you would wear with this dress or not a bra at all if you can. If that's what you want to do. I don't know which perfume to wear today. I think I want to smell edible. I normally do, but I don't want to keep wearing the same stuff, you know? Shall I wear my Burberry Hurry? Well, I feel like I go to the same three things. I either wear my Burberry Hurry Elixir, my Black Opium Le Parfum, or Baccarat. And that's those like give very gourmand. Of course, the original Burberry Hurry gives gourmand as well. Well, I feel like I have other stuff. Maybe Prada Paradox? Um, I just wore my Billie Eilish perfume yesterday, so I'm like, I would wear that, but... This one I had a love-hate with when it came out, because... Wait. Uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna wear this one. I don't know, I just didn't like it when it came out, but... It, like, grew on me. I got it as gratis. <laughs> and I was like, I'm gonna wear it. I'm gonna give it a chance, and... Yeah, now I like it. The bottle, the bottle is just so cute. Like, you you smell kind of good, and the bottle is really cute. You've got, you've kind of sold me. Not gonna lie, you've kind of sold me. <laughs>
speechless. <laughs> I'm speechless. It's a middle down, middle down, middle part, bust down. Mm. Down to the booty. Y'all see it? Don't don't act like you can't see that. Hold on. Let me straighten out my back. Still, still, still by the booty. What do you mean? Like, how can I lose when I already chose? Like, here are my arrogant styles. I literally only go to Jada for my wigs. Uh, Y'all see that? That's scalp. That's my scalp. Shut up. I've been growing this all my life. That's what I'm finna tell my customers. Cause my, I feel like y'all be trying to be funny. Everybody knows what a weave is and what a wig is by now. I mean, I know it's hard to tell because scalp. Don't worry, I'm gonna be telling every. When I have my braid, they're like, oh my god, your hair's so long. How long does it take you to grow it? All my life, duh. No haircut. No haircut. No haircut. 